there's always that sculptural element to our work, whether you're work, working on a piece of jewellery or working on a bowl. We see them all as sculptures, really. Mm. If it's 3D, it's a sculpture. Yeah. <laughs> both of us originally came from art school. We both studied painting and drawing. Dinosaurs started out of really nurturing and looking after our art careers, but in a way it sort of swept us up. And I mean, we've really loved doing it, but we've always wanted to get back to being sculptors and artists again. Because we've always approached everything as an artist would, it's translated now into larger, more exuberant pieces. Yeah. But the, the language that we've been working in and working on for so many years still is involved. We just always produce what we love, and this is what the show's all about. Mm. The new works, the, the major um, input for this, I think, are the totems. They evolved out of an idea I had for creating vases, where I wanted to, to literally build vases from components. You know, I was imagining two or three components to create a vase, and before you know it, I thought, why am I stopping? And then I kept building, and I just thought, wow, these are looking like totems. I think it probably sits in our DNA, the, the nature of totems. And we've often talked about dinosaur as a primitive village. It's just innate to human beings to, to, to create things. And, and then we use this high-tech material, contemporary material. So it's this lovely juxtaposition between those two things. This table here is, is one of my moon tables and it's um, specially cast in, in layers but it's all resin and all cast individually in different colours. So each colour is actually mixed by hand. I wanted this table to have kind of the fluidity and the sort of exuberance of the moon, almost like a jellyfish floating through the ocean at night, you know, that sort of translucent but that free flowing form which resin really relates so beautifully with. We're like a, t yeah. a team, a design team. Yeah, we have a nice conversation Quite often going, ready, we... ready to comment, no matter what. Yeah. <laughs> Whether yeah. it's positive or negative. Yeah. And sometimes yeah. it's, it's negative and you think, oh, really? Oh, I thought it was quite good. And then yeah. you start to think, oh, but hang on, well, maybe it's not as good as I thought. But even more special when Louise says, oh, that looks great. And you think, yeah. okay, fantastic. So yeah, it's nice to have that rigour, you know, yeah. and that, that we're quite open and quite honest with each we're other. We're very honest. I think the importance of touring an original gallery is that you continue to have a conversation with all of Australia. Most communities genuinely love art, mm. there's no doubt. And they love participating, they love doing, and they love seeing. 